Whoa, hello friends, how's it going? This is Jeff playing Ultimate Admiral, Age of Sail, British, cam British campaign on hard land and sea. Next battle is Odyssey. And this one is a very tough battle. I can tell you that I've played this five times and I won once and I lost four, so. Um, I've tried various things because I want to be able to not get wiped out, you know, and I end up, you know, I got 4,050. You'd think that would be enough, but it's not. Okay, now let me see here. What I'm going to do is take one, two, three units, and I'm going to hide them over here in the city. And now these two units, I'm going to put one right here and one right there. Okay, now. All right, and what we're doing is we're trying to get across the water. And I gotta make sure my supply wagon gets across. And my only artillery unit. Now this 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 ain't gonna this probably ain't gonna work, but I mean it's it's something that I have to try. And then while we're over, while we're here, but pause for just a moment. Um, I'm gonna see if I can merge some units. Okay, my supply wagon is getting across and now I can now send this unit across. Okay, so now if they find these guys, um, oh yeah, and then I want to merge these two. My, my plan, my plan is I'm going to hide these guys here. And hope that the AI doesn't see me here. And then I plan to use these guys to come over here and get the flag at the end. That's going to be the plan. I mean, it may not, it's not going to work. Because they might, they get at 50 minutes or so, they'll have three or four infantry over here that they get fresh units and they rush the flag. So, I mean, it's possible that even if their entire force is over here and here attacking me, um, they may still have, and they have, they have um, six cannon units too. So I mean, and they have like 20 
infantry units. I mean, it's a, it's like this is like almost a, and we don't get any allies, so this is almost like a ridiculous battle. I mean, that's what I have discovered that this this one is really um, really tough. All right, so we're gonna try. to hold this area. But I'm also going to need um, I'm also going to need some units to uh, protect over here. So All right, so all small units again over here for a minute so I can match them up. Artillery will go right there. Okay, so let me match these two up. And let me let me match these two up. No, nope, no, nope, they can't, but these two can match. All right, look, you need to walk over here so I can see this unit better. Come on, get out of the way. All right, we'll match those guys up. And I think this one should be able to go with this one. Yeah, okay. All right, now we're, we're going to discover if they find these guys. But they're just going to hide in the city. Okay, there. All right, now you're going to go hide in the woods there. And you're hiding right there. Now you got to get over here. And I think what I have to do is I have to get somebody to walk across there so they see where we are. So he's going to be the guinea pig. Like, I'd hate to think that their whole force is coming down here to take out these two units. Like, 
It looks like they're hiding, so that they shouldn't be seen. Even he can't be seen at the moment, so th they might not know where we are. Usually they have, like I said, if you move all your guys here and your, your supply wagon will be slow. A skirmisher comes over here and melees it. Uh, your, your supply guy runs off. And I, I never think that a hundred infantry should be overpowered by a skirmisher unit, which does happen. So they, they made skirmishers overpowering. I'm just coming over here to see if I can discover anybody. Yeah, I, I I absolutely think that they don't know where where I am. Like I I, I successfully got everybody over to where they don't know where I am. Unless they're 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 assaulting us here. Like I I don't know. Like now, I hope I don't get this unit. Uh, trapped, but we're, we're going to see. Yeah, he, he still can't be seen. Now, the only thing that I can think of that is good is he's at 100% condition, so once I spot somebody we can then try to run away. Maybe. So yeah, like, okay, so now I'm gonna, I'm just gonna tell you that I successfully did this without them seeing me. Like it wasn't, it wasn't slow where the supply wagon was coming slow. Like I put a couple of guys here, like normally they have skirmishers right over here. So uh, yeah, I don't know, it's kind of weird. I mean, they got a massive force. And there's not one... Like, I, I don't even know where they are right now, but they have a massive force. Like, it's almost like 20 infantry units, four skirmishers, and six gun units. And on top of that, at the 50-minute mark, they get another fresh three or four infantry units that rush to this flag, so I still don't see any enemy. Okay, so now they see me Oh, there's one. Okay, now, so now I'm going to run him. Okay, so I'm thinking that they should now know where I am. Now, don't forget, they, once they, once they uh, know, they will come in mass force now. I'm hoping my, yeah, he even missed. Ish. 
Yeah, I'm still trying to get this. I want this unit across here because if not, um, he's going to get surrounded. So now right here we can have a little individual battle with this, this skirmisher. Yeah, see, three skirmishers, and so I told you they have at least four skirmishers. Now my unit, like I said, I, I got him to withdraw. Now this artillery. Look at this. He's my artillery is fired several times, and you're telling me he misses? All right, well, without a doubt, they know where we are. And, of course, yeah. <laughs> well, I told you he was my guinea pig, right? Okay, so now I'm going to get this artillery to hit him. Uh, you gotta hide over there, unfortunately. Well, I'm trying to get that guy to run, but he won't, um, because he's only at 19% condition. All right, so now, come on, guys, you guys got to eliminate that one. And this is kind of hairy, right? They're all here. So, yeah, so maybe you can shoot at that one, right? Maybe, I don't know. You shoot at that one. You shoot at, well, you continue to shoot at that one while you shoot at that one. Maybe that'll work. And wh who should my artillery hit? Why don't we hit him, see if we can wipe him out. Oh, okay, so now you have a... Uh, see if you can hit that one. Unless we hit him to try to kill him. I don't know. No, he's moving away. So hit that one. That one's coming. Ho, ho, ho. No, you guys. Man, boy, do I hate that. Get back over here. Oh, and of course, they're... Okay, so look. Darn it. All right. Yeah, 
to see. We can't see. The, I'm wondering. Oh, look. You go after him. You go over there for a minute. I want to see if we can see one of those artillery. It's not that I want them to cross, but... Hey, now, how is he... I don't believe this. All right. You two over here. You two over here to help this guy right here. Get over here. I'm going to have to expose my position now. Darn it. Like I said, I think they have too much. Now, how are you rear flanked? Is it because of my gun? Oh, and now they brought an infantry over. Okay. Yeah, I've, yeah, I've never seen them bring an, an infantry over. Um, usually, they just have one scrimshaw coming over here. Everybody else, they come over here. Um, so yeah, I might have to defend now in two places. See, the only problem I got here, too, is if the artillery is over here, they're hitting us. Okay, now, what happened to this unit over here? Alright, why don't you go hide here? You hide there. You hide there, then. I don't see that unit. So now, you know, I would, you know, like I said, this was the unit that was the guinea pig, but he could not make it across. <laughs> so now I have an extra unit over there, which I didn't plan on. Uh, you know, as you know, I put three units over there combined to... Oh, but I don't know if I can even get the flag when this Tiber runs out. And if I can hold the onslaught, I don't know. But you can see how they're panning out here. So that's why I had to put a guy, put a unit here. I have to be very selective on who I can. Let's hit, let's hit this skirmisher here. Maybe we can break him. But then again, there's a 200 right there. Maybe you should hit that unit right there. Oh yeah, so he came back. Oh, so how does he magically, you know, um, that, that's, 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 that's weird. He was right there and then he magically goes away. And how did he magically get here? Huh. 
And this one's wavering. And I think, like I said, I think it's because he's getting hit by artillery. So I'm thinking as long as he's like this and I can get him over here, maybe this one won't get hit by artillery. I don't know. But I don't like that this guy just popped across. I mean, this is the, the stupidest things that happen now. Well, you got to be able to shoot at somebody. Man, everybody's blocked, but yet these guys are hitting us. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. And now... This, like I said... Uh, oh, and now I got him right there. Alright, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bust this up. Because I need more units. So you get over there. Yeah, look at this. And you don't even see their six cannons units that they have. And you might think I could probably take these guys and flank them, right? Which I could do, but then they're going to all come after the, these guys and wipe them out. And... Their six artillery units will hit us. So I'm thinking if I put him over there. And now we're at 26. So, you know, technically I think I could. I might be able to come down this road here. It depends on how much they got here. But keep in mind, he's combined and one unit's combined. So I can bust them up and make five units. So yeah, we're at 26. Like, there's no way of getting a wipe here. But I just want to be able to get a win. But this is problematic. The moment they, in fact, I'm wondering if this one's rushing in. So maybe I can... You go over here, but you, you need to hit this unit right here. All right. Yeah, because if we can, I'm wondering, like, i got to figure out how quick that time is going, but you're shooting him and, and you, why don't you go like that and, and you go up here and find that skirmisher. Yeah, I'm wondering at what time should I try to, cause if I get this too early, they're going to just mass charge me. And and like I said, I think they might have their fresh units they get at the 50 minute mark. They might be right around here along with some of the artillery. So yeah, I mean, I don't know if you can squeak out a victory this way. This was just a, a test to see if I can conserve a lot of my force, but... Um, as you can see, this is problematic right here. Look at this. But yeah, maybe maybe I'll make 
Maybe I'll 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 I'll, I'll get these guys going. Right, so that way they'll be on a march. Yeah, you see, yeah, that's what it is. Artillery's over here shooting at my unit here. Now it says friendly fire, um, so maybe I need to shoot at that one. I don't know. But if these guys can hold their own. They just got to hold long enough for me to get that flag. And yeah, you need to shoot him. Okay, now he's going off that way. So then I can get this unit over here. And this unit will go here. And this unit's gonna go this way. And you're going that way. Yeah, now we're at 24, so... Alright. Let's see if... I'm gonna just see if I can go get that flag. He's running off that way, so... Yeah, we don't see the skirmisher. We're just holding them off as best we can. And we're just going to see what is over here. Because, you know, how many units do they have right here? Like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. They have one over here, 17, and they got 6 artillery. Tell the guys to hold so that way they can fire at whoever's in front of them, maybe? Now we gotta find that skirmisher. And this unit needs to get right there. Because I'm not, I'm going to tell you that I know what that skirmisher will do. He will come here and melee him. And he will kill like about 40 or 50 of this infantry unit. Which, this, this unit, I'm going to show you. Yeah, well he has physical, yeah. And morale. Yeah, so I mean, you know, he's got three perks. Not melee perks, but... Cause I, I don't think they let you have melee perks with the uh, supply wagon. But anyways, let me get back to this for a moment. Yeah, like we're gonna... We're gonna... Uh, we're gonna make a beeline to this. Because we're at 22. I don't want to get there too early, but... I do want to get there. Because I want to see if I can do it this way. Because any other way, I get totally wiped out. Like, I'm not kidding you. I, I defend along here, I got wiped out. I defend up here, I got wiped out. I defended over here, got wiped out. I came over here with my whole force and, and took out the four infantry and the two artillery here. So I got those artillery along with my artillery. But eventually... When they got their reinforcements, they all came this way and this way, and they just, they wiped me out. Um, 
you know, so yeah, I'm just letting you know that uh, for informational purposes. But we're trying to hold this. Like, if we can continually hold off. Okay, yep, see? I knew it. Okay, look. I knew it. But because I seen him coming, I took him off so he could shoot at him. And I think that was enough. We lost one, but... What's going on? All right. Well, let's let's let him let's let, let's let let our supply wagon get a little bit of uh, kills. I guess. Yeah. Normally, uh, I'm going to tell you. Like, I I'm going to say normally around, f like. This is 19 minutes left, right? But I've seen them push through here, like right here and stuff. I saw them push through and I I tried this once, but I had a couple of units that got stuck over here and um, they got wiped out and I had to restart it. So now I'm hoping with these guys that they're shooting at somebody. Yeah, see, he, he's blocked, um, but I, if you see this, they, they, some of these guys should be blocked too. They shouldn't be able to shoot, but sometimes I feel that they are all shooting and, and they're wavering my guys and stuff. So yeah, now, who can my gun, yeah, maybe you need to shoot him. Yeah, that should be a direct shot without hitting us. Yeah, and this unit might be shooting at this one. So I'm just trying to hold this. I don't want them to bust through before I, you know, I want to get the flag before that happens. This way I can save some of these guys, you know. I Like, I don't want to. And that's why this unit is going to get right here as backup for any unit that wants they melee. Okay, so let's let's continue on. Yeah, see, and their artillery shooting over this way. All right, look. Let's make a beeline right to it. Come on. So we've got to see what they have. Because I might not even be able to get the flag, maybe. Yeah, their guns are definitely hitting us over here. Our guys are folding. And then that's just going to help them to come across. But that's fine. If their guns are all over here, then maybe there will be no guns over here. And maybe I can get this flag. Because the moment I get the flag, I think it's over. I'm not saying I'm going to get it. Like I, I, This is my hope, but we will see. See, my, this unit here cannot shoot at anybody. He's totally blocked in some way. Oh, and he came back. 
All right then. Well, you got one right here, and you got one right there. Yep, see another one wavering, and he was going to come over here to shoot him. So yeah, I really need you right there. But you two have got to get over here and get him. You got to go look for that skirmisher, and you got to get over here and help out. How close? Oh, yeah, and see, hey, there's a gun right here. Okay, break. And charge. No, why are you going like that? Th Come on, can't you see? I don't get this. Like, why can I not select that unit? Now, this is kind of weird. Is, is this unit like a cavalry bug where you can't see it? All right, then. Then I guess you're going to have to get over here. Come on, why can't we see this gun? Yeah, there we go. We want to charge him. Yeah, and like I said, um, we keep losing guys there, but maybe you can go in the woods right there. We gotta, I'm like, like I said, we gotta hold this off. Okay, now look, you need to be shooting him. And I don't know why you guys can't just go ahead and melee this guy. And yeah, we got somebody retreated way over here, and I'm even gonna put you to melee him. All right, so, and I want this guy to melee, see, melee, and I want this one to melee, to, I don't care if he's blocked, melee, yeah, okay. And you two get right here. Help out in melee in. Can't even see. All right, four minutes. Now we're going to take the flag. If there's nobody here, I don't see anybody. And I think I can bust him into two units, so... I think we got it. Now we just got to hold for three minutes.
Ja. All right, pause. Is it red? Yeah, it's red, so I can finish. There. All right. Woo! Got it. Okay. Nice. All right. There we go. So, uh, anyways, like I said, the that the way you saw me do that, um, I got a victory, and I lost. 962 crew So this is a total that I had from my five ships of this I had 1645 of infantry So I lost 399 and of my crew I lost 962 So not bad I, I was surprised that I, I got to hold that. The key was to hold it and not let them cross. And the having, yeah, so it looks like I, I, I needed those units. I mean, I just barely, I mean, you can see that that large infantry unit, if he if he wiped these three guys out, I wouldn't capture that flag. I did have this unit that I took one of those artillery and I split them up to knock that one out. I probably should have just uh, jumped on it, but then got off and ha have them come over here too to help out. But yeah, that that's, I mean, there's no way of getting a wipe on this particular battle. I mean, they're, they're just too strong. I mean, look at, so I had 4,000, they had 5,280, okay, and they had 15, not 18, but 15 guns. But what it is, is they're divided amongst six uh, artillery units. And so um, you can't see the whole map from where I'm at, but, you know, they have two over here, they have two over here, and they have two over here, like, say, if you spread out this map. And then they have four or five infantry in front of each of those double guns, and it just makes it too difficult. Like, I've done this various times, and I'm telling you, this is the only time, this time is the only time where... I got this victory of because all you got to do is capture that flag, and I got uh, one guy wounded, got a commodore, a captain, that, and we have 138 of these. Not, I mean, not much because you know, like I said, um, I'm trying to think. Let me see how much. Yeah, I killed 1,280 of them. So. Yeah, I only killed maybe one f 25 percent of what they had, not even. Um, and you can see how you know. Yeah, I mean, I could have lost a heck of a lot, but I didn't. So, by doing it this particular way, so that's the strategy that I'm going with. We can look at individual units. Here's my five ships. Two transports. So, the, okay, so they had one, two, three, four. Okay, now this time they only had five. I mean, one time they had six. So, th I don't know why they only had five this time around. And let's see, they had Fuslers. And I don't know what Calvert is. Hmm. I wonder what that is. If anybody knows what, um... Oh! Maybe it was an artillery unit, maybe? I don't know. It's got three... Yeah, it must have been that. Maybe these are the artillery units. No, it can't be, because these are the artillery units. Yeah, I don't even know what that is. Like, if anybody knows, let me know. Do you know what this is? The, 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 those, I don't know what that is, to be honest with you. But I know what a fuseler is. I know what artillery is. I know what Marines are, and I know what uh, 
royal uh, fuchsias are and sailors. Okay, so and, and then of course, yeah, look at this. They had one, two, three, four, five, six skirmishers and, and to be honest, like I've done this, this battle a few times and I, I just think they overpowered skirmishers in some way. I, I don't know what it is that I can say about it, but skirmishers should not win melee, even when they're being supported by, by infantry. Skirmishers should dissolve because I've played this game long enough to know when I have a skirmish unit, it, it gets dissolved so quickly in a battle that I don't even like skirmisher units. You know what I mean? Like, I just don't like them. So, but anyways, that's my point that I wanted to mention, and we will go ahead and end. So, all right, I got myself a victory. Yay. And I didn't lose nearly all my force. You know what I mean? That's the most important thing. So let's look at the uh, three ships. Yeah, so I had a thousand on this one, so we're down to 688, which is not bad. I don't know what I had on this one, but that's not bad, and I don't know. So we did lose an officer there, so let me see. No officers, none, but we did lose one here. Well, I don't want to... Look at this, I have a Commodore, a Rear Admiral, Comm Oh, that's because I took the captains off these ships. Okay, so we don't want to use those guys. Ah, uh, we'll buy... Ah, uh, why don't we put this guy in? Alright. And like I said, these guys are just missing... Well, you know what I could do now? I can put their captains back on. I take the captain off because I want it red so I can't use it so I know which ships I'm going to plug in. If I only need six ships, then I only want six ships available for when I go into the battle. So this, that's how I do it. So, But for right now, I don't know what else ships I'm going to use later on. So I'm just going to put the, the guys, is a Commodore, put him right there. I think we have another Commodore. He goes right there. So yeah, so now all my ships are active again. All right, so let's take a look at the transports. Now, yeah, and check this out, right? I did not lose any of my infantry. Now, I'm going to tell you, I did that battle, Odyssey, like four or five times. And I have lost nearly every unit that I had. I, like, I got wiped out and the war was over for me. So this is the, the one strategy that I just showed you. That was the best way that I could win that on hard difficulty. That was the best way. And I still have a navy. You know what I'm saying? Like, think about it. I still have 600 on this ship. Um, I have still 600 there, and even that one. So all three of these ships that were in the battle, I only lost about... Well, here I know I lost almost 400. But here, you know, I didn't lose too much. I didn't lose too much, man. And then when you look at my two transports that I had in the battle, look at We're still really good. So yeah, I'm really, I'm really happy that I got past that battle. So that was this one, Oda City. I mean, this was hard, and I get three career points. So yeah, um, let's see, what should I do? Well, okay, well, let me see, what's the next battle? Oh, it's Duck Hunting. That one's a tough one. Eight ships. Yeah, so... So then, um, I think... Um, I definitely want to close out damage control. So... Now that gives me 25% to ship repair after battles. 
And on top of that, when I do have to repair the ship in the harbor, I'm minus 25% on ship repairs. So that is good. And I have one more point. And I could go to crew healing. Um, could do that. Or sh maybe, maybe I'll do one for upgrades on ships in case I put any upgrades on the ships. So yeah, if you can take a look, uh, I'll, I think I'm going to end this now, but like I said, uh, my, my Navy is uh, fairly good. Um, you know, like I did that battle and now these have been minimized, but what I think I will do later on is I will drop all of these units down to like this and have them up in the reserves and then I will put those on the ships that are going to go into the battle. That's about the only thing that I can do. So, yeah. Yeah, so with that, I'm going to tell you everybody that I want you to all have a great day. No matter where you are in the world, I hope uh, you're having a good morning or a good afternoon or a good evening. Or just a good day overall. Be kind to each other. God bless to you and your own religion. This is Jeff signing out. And don't forget, if you have any questions, just go ahead and write me a note. So anyways, this is Jeff signing out. Adios, amigos.